new mouse I got. This thing cost a hundred and fifty dollars. I love the grip on it. Put your legs and blanket on the floor. It's Tyson must have ripped it off the couch. So yeah, like I was saying, we're going to see Becca's new tattoo shop. Put up their own spot, which I think is super cool. We're actually going to take her her birthday gift. Just got the gift. I'm just going down for the commute. I'm gonna wear it to Converse. I feel like I'm gonna be cold in this. A couple months ago, I wore these out with my mom. Never, ever would I wear those for long, long journeys. Hey, first things first, these got pretty dirty. And I'm always like super hard on Jess that she poorly maintains her like everyday shoes. But I didn't do a, I didn't do a good job either. Like look, I got, got like stains and shit. I guess when I realized like I wasn't gonna wear them all the time because they were like, fuck it, right? I'm not gonna wear them. So why am I gonna treat them like, you know, they're precious, but still, you know, I wanna be able to I think with these wipes, I'm making the shoes actually worse. I can assure you guys, I am going to absolutely regret this. To my feet and my knees in advance. Tattoo shop, yeah. But it's like the sketchy alley. Oh, bro, at night this would be like creepy as fuck. Is night? No, late, late night, like with the lights off here. Oh, wow. Looks like it's like an office building, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Six? Not too bad. Yes, you may. Yes. Hi. Oh, shit, I'm sorry. Thank you. All right, so we just got back from Becca's studio, her new office space. Congratulations, Keto. Looks amazing. You've done a great job in there. Stay very long, but I was able to get some footage. It honestly is so sick, man, to know somebody that's doing something so sick and just grinding every day and building a brand. Super sick. to see what time the Apple store opens. Camera bags all loaded up. <laughs> the new mouse I bought, which I'll do a little bit of a review on. Thought it was charged. I thought all my batteries were charged. Let's see if this battery's charged. Mm, not quite. We gotta go. Also, asked her if she wanted to come for the ride. Help me pick out an iPhone and actually maybe be a voice of reason for me because I don't need a great iPhone. Honestly, the only reason I invested in the, when I got it, the 11 Pro Max, was with the hopes of vlogging with it, which I did absolutely none of. Didn't like the camera, didn't like the wide angle, didn't like the fact that you still have to turn the camera and hold it with the actual lens facing you to get the same amount of quality, whereas if you did it with the front facing camera facing you, you lost a whole bunch of quality. Just never ended up using it, always, Felt more comfortable using the camera. Bought 
the iPhone 12 mini. I wasn't going in, but even this was expensive, guys. A th almost a thousand dollars, and this is like a year old. So, oof. And look, well, not a thousand dollars. It was like nine hundred and eight dollars. I love that sound. It's so satisfying. But yeah, I got the blue. That blue is really nice. Good choice on the color, though. I can set up my new little miniature iPhone. Oh my God, I still can't get over how small this thing is. I know it's a mini, but still, this thing is tiny. Tell me, let me know what you guys think of the color. Color's sick, right? It actually matches my watch, so. That's my watch, and there's my phone. English, Canada. Gotta wait for all of these apps to download. But I gotta leave my mom's place because I gotta get back home in time to walk Tyson. me tempered glass for 10 bucks and this like cool little phone case so it's magnetic it fits and then the mini has the tempered glass which I'm sure you guys can't really see from that angle for 20 bucks 25 bucks I got this dressed up and it fits and it's small which I like yeah it's just it's like a smoked bacon breakfast actually I gotta make Tyson's dinner too say hi say hi papa Say hi. And then I'll make this at the same time. So Jess and Tyson just went to the LCBO. Plus she took him on his walk. We're gonna go by Lloyd's. I'm gonna work on the edit, but I also just wanna get out, socialize a little bit. I haven't done it much lately because I've just been exhausted and, and a lot of working and just grinding. So I've been editing since 5.15 a.m. I'm not gonna get into why I'm up that early. But I'll tell you the one reason I am up that early is because I fell asleep, I think at like 9.30 last night, because yesterday my work day was brutal. I started at 6 a.m. I finished at 6.45 p.m. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but I need a job where there's more consistent days off and more realistic work hours. Definitely. All right, I'm just making Tyson's breakfast. So it's Sunday. Technically, I should be recording for next week's vlog, but I'm going to work because I made a couple of huge boo boos. So, I just need to talk to a couple of the guys real quick, and then I'm gonna come back home, finish the vlog, and relax. Laundry, you know, the regular, regular stuff. But, and I still have to film some stuff for this week's vlog. Entering through the back of the building. Well, I'm not sure yet. I hope somebody's fucking here, because if not, I'm not gonna be getting in. Went, did what I needed to do. Now I'm headed home. Got the coffee in hand. Ricky was kind enough to buy me one. Thank you, Ricky. I will enjoy this very much. Though he got me, <laughs> I just wanted a small, bro. My boy got me extra large. Uh, we are back home. It's 9.15 now. I want to literally finish the edit before I take Tyson out for his second walk. Are you ready, oh, Bubba? Oh, Are you ready, Bubba? Bubba, Tyson. Tyson. Yeah. Canada. 